Hey everybody, it's Mary with another highlight from Literacy TA's online resources. Here's an easy way to structure a writing prompt in any subject for any topic. 1 by 3 by 10. You'll find it on the Literacy TA website in the Skill Library under Writing Center under Writing Situations. There it is. Or even easier, simply type in 1 by 3 by 10 in the search field. And it should be your first result. 1 by 3 by 10 is a basic structure for a quick writing response in class. Let's say you want your students to summarize the lab they just completed, or synthesize some critical themes in history, or describe a main character, or even list the steps in the process of solving an equation. The one can mean one paragraph, one sentence, one page, any number of things. The three can mean three supporting details or three examples. It could be three steps they took in a process, three descriptive adjectives. The ten can be ten minutes, ten sentences, or you can even change the ten to two minutes or five sentences. 1 by 3 by 10 is just a basic structure and a starting point. You can change the specifics to work for you. One important thing to know is in using 1 by 3 by 10, you should start with a question or a prompt that the students are responding to as they fill in the 1 by 3 by 10 response. It could be an essential question from your daily lesson or focus or a specific task that will show you their skill, or even a prompt for student reflection. Once you've decided on the question that they're responding to, you can throw up the 1 by 3 by 10 instructions on the board pretty quickly and let the students go to work. Let's say you want the students to reflect on something that they've learned, maybe in math. You might be asking students to give you a statement about the specific skill that they learned that day, plus three details underneath that concept, and maybe five sentences to get it fully described. Could be something like this example. Or maybe you want to get more content specific with their writing, such as in social studies. Maybe you want them to synthesize some concepts that they've learned about governments. And you might use the one as one thesis or one claim and ask them for three examples that support that and give them 10 minutes to write, including if they're done early, time to edit and revise. Regardless of your content area, 1 by 3 by 10 is a tool that makes writing across the curriculum just a little bit easier and less intimidating for everybody. And just in case you didn't know, one of my favorite holidays is coming up next week. Yep, the National Day on Writing. That's Monday, October 20th. 20th. So if you want to try 1 by 3 by 10 as a way to celebrate writing, that would be great. And if you want more fun ideas for celebrating writing, either creative or content specific in your classes, check out the ideas on the NCTE website.